Why don't we just go ahead and we'll start the timer. Let's say welcome back to Harvest Moon GB. Oh, actually I wanted to change the stream title to reflect the GB so I don't have to add it in later like I did before. Update. Done. There we go. Just like that. Okay, so now, welcome back to Harvest Moon GB. Uh, we are at day four of the fall season, year one, uh, of possibly only one year, if necessary. Uh, on the tenth day of fall, there's going to be a vegetable festival. So, fingers crossed that that gives us like another one of our little berry things or whatever. Here's our little dog, Logue. What's our weather like tomorrow? Sky will be clear tomorrow. I'm assuming that they're clear today. How are my cows and chickens doing? Unhappy. Milk size? Medded cow. Okay. So, I'm not very familiar with the terminology. But the fact that it says milk size seems to indicate that I could actually finally milk a cow. Uh, milk a cow. Call. I can finally milk, milk a cow. Uh, the chickens like me again. Um, <laughs> after the uh, the last day of the summer season was a typhoon that wiped out all my crops and forced me to stay inside so I could not do anything. And so all the chickens hated me for not feeding them that day, but it was like a forced event. So now they like me again. Got the dog Logue, got the ho the horse, me, even though the game says house, it is supposed to be horse. The game also says pass sessions up there. I got $23,000. I don't really have much to spend it on. Oh, I wanted to actually also double check my food and drink. Yeah, we're good on both of those. So let's, uh, let's tend to some cows, right? Bring the dog outside. I don't think I have the... Yeah, I need that, and then let's also grab... Oh, I do need the brush. Um, I don't... Hmm, I don't know if I need the, uh... I don't know if I need the bell right now. Uh, okay, so the cow looks maybe slightly larger? Yeah. So, that's nothing. Yeah, okay, so that was, that was incorrect, I guess. They run away from me. Like, I push them away. So I think that's really just indicating that I will have the ability to milk the cow soon. I'm gonna come back in just a minute. But first, now that I've brushed them, I can replace that with this. And I can also... Uh, actually, the sprinkler more than the milker is going to be necessary. So I can hopefully get the cows out the door a little bit here too in a second, but first I need to feed them all. And I need to talk to them all. Hello Cash, you look fine today. Hello Money, you look fine today. Hello 5000, you look fine today. Uh... Who wants to come out for a walk? Oh, you do? Maybe not? Come here.
So you have to push them out the door. <laughs> and then you get a little cutscene. The manual just says to do it every once in a while. Um, I have no idea if I should be doing it every day, but I'm going to try to do it every day. Uh, I'm hoping it will increase their happiness. Here. Not you. I've done. I've done yours. Uh, somebody want to come over here? Tell you what, you go this way. This is not working. Am I able to get multiples out at the same time? Not to get multiples out at the same time. All right. Well, I'm assuming this is a different cow. I couldn't really fully keep track, but Go that way. You come down here. You're the toughest one to get out the door. Dude, come on. There we go. That looks like happy eyes to me. Alright, so I think I'm done with the cows. Uh, time to water and gather crops. Oh wait, no it's not. Time to do chicken stuff first. Oh god damn it. Um... These chickens get in the way so easily. It's such a small little area. Uh, you go there. You can't push them like the cows either. You can carry them. But not while you're carrying an egg, because then you'll throw the egg and break it, and lose out on some money. Alright, chickens are done. Let's place the cowbell with the sickle, which I think I'm going to need. For that? Oh, me. Let's see if we got a crop yet. I don't think we have anything growing. Alright, we do not. I missed.
Okay. Um, oh, I need to actually stick with these, don't I? Ooh, okay. You can never reach the middle one anyway, uh, to water them all, so it's like I'm doing this just so I can be like a little bit more efficient with my, my watering. Something I kind of learned a little bit too late in the day. I don't have much for profit yet still. Damn it. That's four eggs worth. I don't have anything to spend money on so far, so... Um, and then I got all these seeds. I miss... misplanted. At one point. So I'll have to figure out how I want to deal with that a little bit later. That's everything. Except for doing the sickling. Uh, which... Hold off. I'm gonna bring the axe? And see if they'll actually talk to me about the hammer yet? I think I missed the up opportunity to upgrade the, the sickle. And I don't know, I, th I think there's supposed to be a, a, there's supposed to be a way to get a pickaxe, but I don't know if it comes from these guys or what. I still need a fishing pole, haven't gotten a fishing pole. So I, I, there's stuff I don't know how to get, but I know it's in the game. And some of it might be year two only. I don't know. Tough to say. The manual says that, you know, some stuff, but it doesn't tell me everything. Alright, so... I replaced the axe with the brush, so I'm ready to go in the morning with that. And let's go cut some grass. Ready to be cut? Yeah, okay. see if I can do a milking tomorrow. Alright, so I can't play anything else. Let's call our dog. Let's get a little run outside. Put you over here by my bed. And then that's it. Like, I'm out of energy already, surprisingly. Maybe I stayed up late. Um, see, so yeah, I have like five of these things which are the stamina berries. I found most of them from tilling.
clear your day. Cow's still unhappy. Uh, so, yeah, I probably can't milk. I'll try. Hang out over here by the wood. I don't know what it takes to make them happy. Like it's working. It's nothing I'm putting there, so um Let's bring him out for a walk. We're pushing you out first, 5,000. if they would like a rainy day. I have no, like I said, I have no idea if it's necessary to do this every single day. Um, but it's something to do, and time doesn't pass once you're in these areas, which is really cool. It's like you're running away from me. Go that way. Uh, I'll come back this way. No, you can stay there. Dum dum. Call you specifically. so hard. Ugh. All of you. Out. Let's try this again. Thought he was gonna be moving. Are you all bad at this? Let's 
Let's see, go that way. You go this way. Through the door. Thank you. There we go. That's the toughest part right there. Report some more spam text here. Cool. All right. So we fed them all. We've said hi to all of them. Uh, took take them all out. Off to the chickens now. It'd be a lot easier if you could just get rid of all these instruction signs, because I don't need them anymore. It really doesn't matter what I get rid of there. I can get rid of both. I'm going to assume... Oh my goodness, I do have crops already. Let's ride. Um, wow, those go really fast. I'm gonna have to go to town and buy some more seed. Let's actually do that real quick before it gets to be a problem. Man, that's weird because I, I staggered them a little bit. I think. Maybe I didn't. Okay. Um... Eggplant seeds, one bag is... How many do I want? Let's go... You know what? Just get a bunch because I... That way I don't have to come back again... The next day. Oh, and I forgot about the whole praying thing. That's like a thing I can do. I don't need any wood because I've already upgraded my house as full as, as, full as I can. And we're gonna pray. Welcome, Gianneco. How are you? Uh, why no, I have not. I'm on like the fifth day of fall, so I still have. Ugh, 30 days left before I even find out. Tool shop, there's nothing in the tool shop. Restaurant, I can buy some rice balls. I was thinking about buying a cake. I'm not gonna buy a cake. And then at the animal shop, I think I've gotten everything I need. I can't buy a chicken because I have all my chickens. I don't want to buy a fourth cow because I want to raise it. I want to like, you know, uh, use the stuff I have and I don't want to sell anything so there's nothing I need to do there. Oh, horsey. We need to... Ride horsey. We gotta, we gotta take care of some stuff. Oh, this is a problem. Come here, you. Let's see here. Uh, oh, I 
can't pause while I'm the horse. Okay. Oh my god, there's so much. I'm not going to be able to get to all of it. So planting eight is not good, because I'm not going to have enough time to like harvest eight within the time period allotted. So I got six. Yeah, 3,100. Here's the here's the problem. I'm gonna have all of these as well uh, tomorrow, ready to go. Um, let's do. A little bit of watering. I really hate the way the darkness looks in this. It's very, very difficult to see, which I know is, you know, that's the point, right? But the default color palette that the Game Boy Color gives you, or Super Game Boy gives you, is not, not fun to look at. Stupid. Still need a water. And hopefully plant. I don't know, we'll see if I can. Um Pickaxe, please. I need a pickaxe, please. Everything's watered now, um, except for potentially new crop. So let's get. Uh... I know you're tired. I know you're tired. I'll get you. Oh man. I 
messed up the seating. Time. Hope the dogs are right. He's just been outside the whole time. Now it's still unhappy. How long does it take for the cows to be happy? It's been six days. Dog is still outside. Well, also, how long does it take for there to be uh, another an adult cow? Because these other ones, I think, I don't know if I put out an extra food, will they be happy? I need to swap both of these out. Suck. Let me pause for a second. Um, Trying to see if there's anything about this medded cow thing, because I mean that I don't know that word at all. I don't know what that's supposed to mean for me. It says use the milking machine when they're finally ready to give milk, but it didn't seem like they're ready to give milk, possibly because they're unhappy. Uh, so yeah, I just don't know how to make them happy. Uh, I don't know where which cow is what. Okay, so this is. Okay. I've been doing that. I've been putting the feed there every day. I'll try just calling them and walking them and. There's so much broken English in this game that I don't know if it's like a mistranslation or if I just don't, you know what I mean? Like, I, I don't know. 
I'm missing something. Hey, Nansen, how are you? Uh, uh, I mean, there's there's a lot of people who still do like manual milking of cows, so. But yeah, it's definitely tedious if you have a lot of them, I'm sure. Can't be easy. But this top cow is definitely big enough. It's just unhappy. And so I need to... Hopefully... Hopefully get it on my side very soon. Get out there. Get out there. Oh. Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know what meted is supposed to mean. M E T E D. Alright, I've done everything I can do with the cows. On to the chickens. There's a lot of stuff I wish I could do in this game that I don't think I can do. about this game that does not make sense and they do not explain very well. At least the chickens are happy. Let's replace the cowbell with the sprinkler and then the brush can... That, and then I need to quickly harvest. <laughs> oh, so they use picket as well? I'm not sure if I've seen that one. I would not put it past it. Guess it means you've given out or doled out some form of thing? <laughs> I don't know if that's really... Yeah, I think it's probably a misinterpretation. Like, my, my thought process was, like, maybe it meant mated cow, but I have not used the, the potion for it yet. You know, there's, like, a, a potion to basically impregnate the cows, which I have. I bought it. Uh, I didn't want to do that until I have two... Um, until I have, like, two milk-producing cows. Or at least, you know, maybe a little... Oh, jeez. Messed that up. Alright, well, I just lost two crops. Like a dum-dum. Or hot rod or something. You need to come over here, of course. I, I've bred a couple chickens on my own. Right, like you know, that's easy. You just grab one of their eggs and incubate it until it grows up. That's not a problem. Um, but I, I feel like Grandpa's spirit will like it better if I don't just buy four cows, if I actually, like, you know, breed one on my own. So I'm gonna try to do that. Otherwise I'd have a full stable right now. Yeah, it just seems like having... Eight... Eight batches. Quit running away, horse. Eight batches of crops is too much to get done before the uh, the deadline.
Ooh, just made it. Just made it. 4,000 gold. Yeah, it's not much money. And, okay, so I'm, I'm leaving those there. Um, because it seems like anything you drop off in the box after 5 p.m. just does not count. Like, it doesn't carry over the next day or anything, I don't think. <clears throat> oh, the the eggplants that I threw on the ground? It, it shows, like, a little smashing animation, I guess. So it's basically trying to say, oh, you threw them, but you dropped it on the ground. So, whatever. Uh, is a picket a farming tool? There's, like, a pick... Yeah, like, a pickaxe or something like that. Or a pick. Um... Or a picket fence, which is like, you know, just a style of fencing. There is a pickaxe in this game, uh, but I have not come across it yet. So maybe once I get that, then I'll see the picket that you're talking about. Ooh, interesting. I, uh, one of the old, really the only reason I bought the Switch uh, three pack Mario Anniversary thing is because of Mario Sunshine, and I did not want to spend like fifty plus dollars on the GameCube version when I could spend you know the same price and get three games, even though I already own two of them. It didn't matter. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm not a farmer either. That's why I was thinking like meted might be an actual term, but. And surprisingly, I already had Thousand Year Door. It's one of, like, four GameCube games I own. I don't know why I bought it, but I did. How many more games will that cover? That's 600 bucks. It's, it's a rough market right now. Unless this game takes place in the 1800s. I don't... don't know. I don't know. Um, okay. There's nothing to really indicate the time period except for, you know, like, here's this sprinkler thing, but that's not... I'm trying to think if there's anything, like, ultra-modern in it. And not really. some additional stuff here but first let me go over here I'm just gonna try to keep feeding this guy until he gives me some if he ever gives me something because this is the sign where it says use the pickaxe to pass through here I don't have the pickaxe I've never been offered the pickaxe I'm assuming he might offer it to me. Then he might give me the fishing rod, because there's all this water around here. Maybe it's just a completely random event. WarioWare Inc., Wario World. Ooh, that would be fun. Melee, Twin Snakes, Zelda Wind Waker. Do I have Wind Waker? I, don't, I can't see my GameCube games from here, so I might have Wind Waker as well. Chibi Robo. That's a, that's a tough one, isn't it? That's another pricey one. Second and third TMNT games. I'm not familiar with the uh, GameCube Turtles games. Both Harvest Moons, Midway Arcade Treasures, Game Boy Player. I'm glad I bought my Game Boy Player when I did.
Uh, I need to plant more stuff. Here's what I'm going to try to do. Buy the orange juice. And hope that like refills my stamina like right now. So I don't need to water those because they're already, you know, they're ready to be picked up tomorrow. Really hard to completely tell that I'm watering all the seeds, but I'm pretty sure I am. Uh, and then I've watered all of this now. Um, no grass to cut down. I think we're good. Uh, planted stuff. Let's call our doggy. And we'll go inside. Yeah, it sounds like you got a lot to build. Hopefully I have some good stamina now. Clear day tomorrow. Are the cows happy yet? Unhappy. And it says milk size is nothing. And I'm, again, because I'm assuming it's because they're unhappy. Second cow is still just a cow. I don't know how to make them... ...medded cows where they're available to have milk. I feel like I bought the second cow like two days later. And yet it's still, like, lagging behind. I don't know what to do. Well, that's pretty cool. I did, yeah, I didn't, have, I didn't know anything about the Turtles games. Lost them all years ago. Oh, that's rough. I think I've been lucky enough to not really lose much in my collection. I think the only thing I can think of offhand is um, Mario Kart 64 and then maybe one other 64 game I lost in college. So I let my friend borrow it, then he let somebody borrow it, and then I never got it back. So. But yeah, good luck to you with the rebuild. Should be a fun... Fun playthrough once it's done. Uh, we'll put you over here. Oh, I never swapped out my tools. Let's go. Grab them. No, I'm not gonna grab the milker. I don't need the milker. Sprinkler can go with the cowbell. Let's go brush some cows. How long does it take before they become happy? Let's see. Box for milk, milk here, feed install, put feed here every day. Put the mated cows in here until they give birth. Uh, 
I'm really confused. What if he is already, like... What if this cow is somehow already, like, mated, and I need to just get them? Like, how that would have happened, I don't know. Let's see if I can get them in there. Maybe that's the trick, right? No, come on guys, over here. Well, there's the big one running away. You are a pain in the ass. I really wish I knew if this was a misspelling thing and it is actually a mated cow and I need to have him give birth. But I never gave it like the medicine or whatever to impregnate it. God damn it, man. Like, it's so finicky. You go up there. No, 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 Come on, come on. You get out of there. You go down here. Go down here. You get the hell away from this thing. No, 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 no. What are you doing? Go, 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 go. It's like I'm trying to... I wish I could, like, pick them up. I don't think it's working. I don't think this is how it works. Alright, well somebody go outside then. Which one of you is going outside? Neither one of you went out there? Oh, come on. Ugh. <laughs> oh, no, just... Okay, so... Is that, is that like a real word? Thank you for looking that up. So, a metted cow... So they're okay. So it's not mated. So okay, I'm I'm glad that whatever what I was doing isn't working. Um, so basically, what I just need to do is just take all these cows outside then. All right, come here. Whoever gets here first is going. I gotta try to make them happy. Maybe maybe taking them out every single day is not helping with their happiness, but I think it is. Is used in heavy context. Hmm. So, so your GameCube collection, you just like completely lost it, or did you sell some of them as well at one point? Ah, it's so hard to navigate these guys. You get the hell out of here. Oh, come here. You go, you go away. I don't want you.
See, the manual doesn't give much context for this. It basically makes it sound like you can just let the cows out whenever you want to. And then you ring the bell to bring them back in. That's what the manual actually says. It says, you know, use the bell to bring the cows back inside. Um, does not seem like that's what the cowbell is used for. It's like most of my day. I'm glad time doesn't pass in there. Because it's like most of my in-game time each day is spent on moving those cows around. Had the opportunity to grab all your GameCube and set them up for the Game Boy Collection. Hmm. I think, um, I mean... It, it's hard to go wrong with either way, honestly. I know hindsight's kind of like 2020, but... This horse. It's not as friendly as it seems. Just put it that Horse, I'm telling you, man. It's messing things up for me. Hey, I didn't tell you to go over there. Oh, jeez. Not getting my chance to get in the daily prayers that the game seems to want me to do. Quit running away. Well, I got all of them through. That's all. Yeah, not not much money, unfortunately. Do I have seeds on me? I don't have any seeds on me. I need to plant some more stuff real quick here. I 
miss the days of the corn and the uh, tomatoes. Much easier. This is kind of a pain. Do more over here. Uh, geez. Go in here. See these guys. Slim chance you might get them back. Yeah, I mean. So okay, so you you know where they are basically in a sense, but it's a matter of like complicated relationship stuff. It sounds like. <laughs> So it's better to just rebuy, rebuild. So not physically lost. up my water big time. There's some grass I could grab, but I don't think I'm gonna have the time, so. Let's try to actually... Alright, so yeah, pretty soon... Pretty soon is going to be the, uh... The vegetable festival thing. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. And honestly, you know, if you end up getting this stuff back magically, then... Great. Then, you know, you can just sell it again. Or sell the stuff you bought. And keep your originals. Hey, there we go. Cow health. Milk size is M. So I can actually milk my cow. Uh, second cow is still unhappy. Third cow is still unhappy. And also not a... Huh. It also doesn't say metted cow. Anymore. Huh. Chicken's still okay. What am I supposed to do there? Food, still plenty of food, still plenty of drink. $31,000. I don't know what to do with my money, to be honest with you. Milk the cow. Yay. Alright, 
I'm assuming I just get one. Ugh, it's so impossible. And it like wastes stamina every time you do it too. Wait, 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 you're getting cornered. Maybe I didn't talk to them yesterday, but I thought I talked to them yesterday. No cash, you're looking good. More money. Well, 5,000, you're looking good. Uh... Hey, you want to try to, uh... Escape out the door? Escape out the door without me using the bell? Go this way, go this way, go this way, go this way, go this way. Maybe they don't like the bell. And so the more I ring the bell, the more unhappy they get. I feel like there's a lot of hidden mechanics in this game. Just walked, walked with me that time, that's nice. Um, oh, we get to see the gopher thing. <laughs> I do like that they have a few different cutscenes available. Come on down. Come on down. I'm not sure how much they cut. Uh, you know, I'm not familiar with the SNES game all that much. Um, I do wish there was a little bit more interaction with the townspeople. Maybe a couple more events would be good. There's no relationship uh, progress or anything like that. It'd still be good to have, you know, the ability to go talk to the villagers. I do need to use my sickle at some point here, too. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to get a chance. I'm going to see if I can go into town and do the prayer. Oh, I can't even go to the carpenter. Is everything close right now? No. Oh. Too early? Alright, well now it's 8, so can I do it now? Again. Uh, nothing from the carpenter. Can I help you? It's pretty, yeah. I wonder how many. 
events are in the SNES one. Well, I mean, Summer was kind of disappointing. Um, because the only event, quote-unquote, was the very last day of summer when the typhoon came by and just wiped out all the crops. Like, that was considered... Well, I guess the... There was the earthquake as well, but that also was kind of nothing. I keep hoping to see a pickaxe. Let's do the lunchbox. That's nine o'clock. Oh, there's no crops to pick up today, huh? I need my sickle to clear those guys out, and then I just need to water everything else. Okay, so we're, we're good. Don't need you, Mr. Horsey. I get to water my seeds in the daylight today, thank you very much. But yeah, the earthquake, uh, that was just one of the sprites in the cave needed a rock to be hammered off of him. And it also cleared up uh, those big large rocks that were in the cave. But I have not been able to do anything with that since... milk thin. Not much. Or at least a medium milk is not much. Um, I think that's everything except for getting rid of all this grass. So let's go ahead and These guys. So I think, yeah, I think tomorrow's just going to be an event day, which probably means I won't be able to do a whole lot of farming during the day, which probably won't be that bad. Got my sickle ready to go. I'm not too worried about this anymore. I'm almost positive I have, you know, um, all the grass that I'll need for the summer or the winter.
And I can always just go buy cow feet or chicken feet if I have to. Careful to not accidentally cut any seeds down. Juice bar's closed. Puppy. Let's see how it goes. Oh, sorry, it's the next day. This is the ninth. The mountains are beautiful colors. The sky will be clear tomorrow. So yeah, on Sunday. We got milk. We got a medded cow. We got a regular unhappy cow. <laughs> Making progress. Don't know if that's supposed to be... Yeah, he's unhappy, but at least I got one cow that I can milk. Um, and I do have medicine just in case they get sick. I bought that in advance. Sure takes a lot to make these cows happy. I'm wondering if I should uh, just try to, like, you know, I know this has only been like one day of milking, but like, I wonder if I should just start the process now, because it's going to take a while for the baby to grow up into an adult that can actually provide me with milk and stuff. <laughs> and so I might, I might try that. I guess I'll wait till after the event. Alright, just making sure that like the M doesn't mean I get to have two. Um let's walk you out, huh? So maybe, what, like another three, four, five days or something like that, he'll be happy. I mean, I certainly don't need the money from milk. They're happy when they start walking with me, I guess. I'm 
try to avoid using the cowbell. I don't know if it just doesn't seem like it's worth messing with. Done with the cows. Chickens are easy. Oh goodness, I got a crop already. Saddlebags. Escaping. No. Ah, come on, lunch. This way. It's got more grass I can cut. Got to plant some stuff now. It's really hard to get the uh, positioning right for me. I always go farther down in the grouping of three than I need to. Glitchy patch of grass. What is that? Is that should that mean something to me? Should I maybe try to till that up? Hmm.
I don't have to fix itself, so I don't know. Uh, it should probably plant more. Let's see if I can get through and, um, friends here first. They say that they're gonna try to help me, but they haven't done anything in, like, a season and a half. I feel like I should ship at least one mushroom. I don't think I've done that yet. Maybe there's going to be some sort of a... berry associated with shipping one of each thing. Two bags, so I should definitely go back to town and get more tomorrow if if it allows me to. It might not though. Don't think that's a euphemism. Um, your pet. There we go. Let's go on in. I think tomorrow's an event. Over here. We'll go to sleep. Hi, Platt. This is wild grape juice. I know this is a little sweet, but please have some. Why, thank you. Uh, okay, that's not the event I was expecting to happen. I greatly appreciate that offer, but the manual says on the 10th day of fall is the vegetable festival. Maybe that'll happen some other time. We're gonna take a very quick break. I'll be right back, and we'll continue on.
I am back. Um, so if I'm allowed to just go about my day, then I think I will... Oh, I need to check the... Uh... I need to check my stats for one. Do you need the brush and the milk or still so that's that's dumb. Um, let me go back to the house. The dog is still inside because we had the little cutscene. Yeah, so still the same situation there. Oh, that's fine. We're good. Oh, I can keep milk to drink as well. I don't know how I do that, though. Check the weather. Getting colder, it'll rain all day tomorrow. Oh, cool. Okay. I definitely want to go back in town and grab more seeds. Uh, let's finish up with the cows first, though. Let's do the cows and chickens, and that'll be good. Alright, so I... Need to brush you all. Um, actually, let's let's walk. We'll walk our cows, and then I'll give it the magic potion. Just how baby cows are made, obviously. Yeah, let's go this way. Yay. Nice little happy. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I feel like this might get a little bit rough when I have four of them all together. Hey, VPN, how are you? Thanks for stopping by in the following earlier. I appreciate it. Farm life's going pretty well. It's it's difficult to know if I'm doing things right. I'm in the 10th day of fall, which I'm not sure how much experience you have with these games, but uh, I'm also going to try to now give my cow the magic potion, which will allow it to give birth. There it goes. That cow is now pregnant. <laughs> um, I have a ton of money. I have nothing to spend it on because my house is fully upgraded. I've tilled the whole farm. I've planted as much crops as I possibly can and still have time at the end of the day to be, you know, not fully exhausted. It's an interesting game. It's much more relaxing than some of the stuff that I get to play. But, uh, yeah. Going pretty well. Yeah, the magic of video games. 
You don't want to actually, you know, have bowls or anything else. No, it's just a cow-shaped pill. That creates babies. Um, I have no idea how to actually win this game. The, the win condition that I have for it is to make my grandfather happy at the end of the year. Uh, I have no idea how to check my progress on that front. Oh, I don't have... I don't have some of my supplies. But it's a pretty neat one. But anyway, yeah, thank, thank you very much for stopping in. Uh, basically what I do here is, you know, similar to what you do, but I just focus on Game Boy exclusively. Uh, original North American Game Boy. I play everything on original cartridges. So I have the Super Nintendo with the Super Game Boy 2, and so if I don't own the game, then I can't play it. And uh, trying to collect them all, and then play them all, and then beat them all. Uh, and I do have a way to have viewers select future games. I basically have a randomized raffle, so if you're willing and wanting to join that, um, then that's a way to vote for some upcoming games. Every 25 games is like a milestone game of my own if my own picking, like the heavy hitters, so like you're gonna see like the Turtles games and the Mario Lands and all that kind of stuff, and all that. Yeah, I'm glad I was able to finally, you know, chat. I've chatted like once or twice in yours as well. It's really hard for me to watch streams um, with sound on because I'm usually like working. Um, don't need that. Thankfully, time stops it here. Or I'm watching things with my wife, and so I can't really have sound on. Because we're watching things together. So I, I support a lot of the challengers on mute. So I'm there in spirit. But thanks for stopping in, I appreciate that a lot. I've been at this for a long time. Very, very slow growth, which is perfectly fine. I'm not trying to act like I'm complaining about that at all. Uh, I keep hoping there's going to be something new in the town, but there isn't going to be anything new in the town. You can pray in this game, which I've been doing quite often. I have no idea what impact it has. <laughs> I didn't get to check uh, Nick's channel over um, on, on Friday. Did he did he get a chance to beat Space Harrier? Do you know? Yeah, it's really tough. It, you know, like if you're not streaming yourself, you know, it, it's work. <laughs> you know. I will buy a cake. I don't think I need the cake, but I will buy the cake. Oh, so on it. And then you're still on Road Rash GBC, right? Making dinner? Yeah, I'm all done with that. It's also tough for me to stream more than, you know, three or four hours a, a day. So that's, you know, I've been at this off and on. There, it's it's honestly, unfortunately, possible for me to take weeks or months off at a time without planning for that to happen. Um, so sometimes I just disappear from streams, which makes it tough to build any sort of audience. Oh, shoot, those are ready. Those are ready. Uh, Chianaco, is that a new vote for you? I will have to check one second. I think you voted on that one. Um, it's, it's the puzzle platforming one, or at least one of the ones. Yeah, you voted already. You got the, uh, Klax and Rescue of Princess Blobette in there. I definitely know the feeling on that. I think the only time I really had any major problems with 
needing to move on from a different game is uh, Penguin Wars. <laughs> so advance warning to you, BPN, about Penguin Wars. For Game Boy, there is a ending that most people don't know about uh, that comes if you win 40 matches in a row. And I think it's impossible. I had to use a level select cheat code. Most people spend about 10 minutes on that game because they, you know, it's not well advertised that that ending exists. And, uh, it was, it was a pain in the ass. It made me so angry. So, I will never pick that game for you. Just so you know. Sorry. Oh, I'm... Damn. That's too bad. I was way off of my priorities. Alright. I, I think the way this game works is that if you try to put any of these crops into your bucket for shipment after 5pm, then it just does not give you the money. Yeah, that's very true. Oh yeah, and it's an, uh, BPN does everything. He's streaming every console in existence that's considered retro. I don't know what your cutoff for retro is right now, though. You're not up to PS2 yet, right? I mean, obviously you have plenty to get to in the meantime. <laughs> so... Although, okay. Um... I will say that I'm not going to be completely Game Boy. I do plan to do CDI at some point as well. Uh, I just need to get my system to work. I need to replace the Timekeeper chip. And then I can start streaming some CDI. And this game has these under uh, underworld gnomes, sprites, whatever, and uh, they're supposed to help you in some way, and they did very, very early game and not since, so I don't know. Legend of Zelda CDI. I only have one of the three. So I'm waiting to purchase two of this, <laughs> two of those. But it's honestly a console I'm really looking forward to digging into. I love the jankiness. I, I'm all for that. Um, I love FMV stuff. So I'm, I'm ready for it. Alright, everything's watered. So the, um, so the event that the game said I was going to have in the 10th of fall just never happened. Call the dog, get him to run a little bit. I don't know if manners. Laser Lord? Okay, is that a good something? I do have Laser Lords. I probably have a good, like... Uh, I haven't counted in a while. 30 to 50 games for it. Up past Retro, you're up to Wii U. Okay. Gotcha. Mixed bag has some good and some bad. It looked really interesting to me. Um, one that I'm interested in, in getting into is one of the more rare games. I forget what it's called exactly. It's like Pyramids of something. It's like an adventure game about diabetes? What's it called? Pyramids? I don't know. There's also a strip poker game on CDI that I have, and a Monty Python game, Escape from Planet Skylon, Skytron, something like that. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to stream either one of those. I'm assuming that animated nudity like a Mining Python is going to be fine, uh, but Strip Poker, that goes all the way. 
<laughs> voice acting some of the worst, then I'll probably love it. I love that. That's what makes, like, Shenmue so good. Alright, so we got Cash. He's healthy, or she's healthy. Uh, 21 days until delivery. Okay, glad I started that now. Um, we got money. He's still unhappy. And then 5,000, which I named after how much the cows cost to buy. Uh, so I got cash, money, and 5,000. Unhappy. I really want to go to a convention. There's one in Wisconsin. I'm, I'm in Chicago, so there's one in Wisconsin that I really wanted to go to, but I just, I couldn't, I don't know. Stuff always comes up to prevent me from going there. But I really want to flesh out my Game Boy collection with like a bunch of, you know, sports games and stuff that I don't want to buy on eBay. And hope to find some CDI games that I don't have. You know, one of these days I'll get up there. Hopefully you find some good stuff. Are there any consoles that you're playing right now that you can't really... Whoops, I think I just lost an egg. Um, any consoles right now that you can't really... Emulate? Where you have to buy the physical stuff? That's weird, I guess. Only three eggs? Why is there only three eggs? No chickens, you gotta get out of the way. I don't think I can just put it in here. Nope. Alright, all y'all need to go over here. Yeah, that'd be my plan. I I'm a baseball card collector on top of games, and so I've gone to several card conventions where I usually wait until Sunday to buy the, the biggest ticket items. So the game convention I probably only go on the Sunday. Alright, so I'm done with the chickens. I need to start with the cow. Uh, need a milker? I forget if he's giving milk or not. Decent amount that don't have ever drives. Oh, uh, yeah. PS2. Oh. It's weird. Yeah, the CDI. That's... There are so many, like, demo discs that are on eBay, and I don't trust that they're... I think a lot of people just burn them. I don't think they made demonstration discs for every single... Every single game that existed. Uh, so then I put the food there. Yeah, okay, cool. Alright, let's try to walk these cows. Are they hard to replicate? Interesting. Alright, Nelson, have a good night. Appreciate you stopping by as always. Good luck with your GameCube rebuild. Um, I think I need the bell. They're not going to be down here. I also don't know if it's a good idea to walk them in the rain, but I'm going to try it. So many unknowns with this game. My CDI is in really good shape, and it actually has a tray that works. Um, it's just the Timekeeper chip. Did you have yours redone? I was watching you play the name that tune. It's such an interesting game. 
I played that with my brother one time, and it's just shocking that it's all honor system. That's crazy. Just straight from 10 pieces. Yeah, my system's fine, except it's just the timekeeper chip. Then I have the uh, digital video cartridge as well. That was good. I have most of the different controller types except for the light gun. Well, I guess it's... I don't know if it's specifically a light gun. I don't have the gun peripheral. Yours has a battery? Mine has mine is one of the types that has the the battery embedded into the chip itself. And so um yeah, we did we tried to replace the chip uh but my brother who is much more in depth with the soldering and everything than I ever would be um he wasn't able to get the chip out and like he broke a solder point. So we're still going to I need to take it to a place to have them replace the chip for me. It's the long and the short of it. And then we'll put it back together. And then I'll be able to play games. And save progress in my Zelda game. And play Earth Command. Earth Command is another one that I own that um, it does not work in your system if your timekeeper doesn't work. It just goes to a black screen after um, the initial cutscene. That's how I found out my timekeeper was broken. Researching why my copies of Earth Command didn't work. I've heard horror stories about sending these things in. Uh, that basically, like, yeah, they'll fix your problem, but they're going to harvest your system for parts. So, you know, like, the fact that my disk drive works and, like, the belt rubber band is okay, <laughs> that may not be true if I give it to the guy on eBay. I'm in no major hurry. I got a lot of Game Boy stuff to play. Oh my goodness, these are ready too? Alright, well I'm not going to be able to harvest all of this. Horse, get over here. Quit running away! That's about all I can do. Once five o'clock rolls around. Uh, actually, before it hits, I'm going to see if I can actually ship a mushroom. very intrigued by that model. I'll have to, I don't know, I, I might want to try to get a backup CDI at some point, but space is a little bit of an issue for me at the moment. Jumping the old hot springs. I'm really looking forward to the Clue games that are on um, CDI as well. Those look really... look really neat. I played like one of the cases um, when I finally got my digital video cartridge. Yeah, that's it. 3190. I need to plant seeds before I do anything else. Which means I need the sprinkler, because this gets rid of the sprinkling. If 
But I've never played a clue, clue game like that. It, it's, um... It's something you can do with two players, oddly. And, uh, the, um... I don't know, it, it's sort of like a point-and-click adventure game. And so if you're playing with two players, you know, you're asking the different characters questions of, you know, did you do this? Did you do that? And on your controller, you can choose button one for to have them tell the truth or button two to have them lie because you're both going to be watching the screen as a two-player game, right? Uh, so it's, it's really interesting that they add a mechanic so you can kind of throw your opponent off the scent. The only downside is that there's only three cases per per disc. I love Battleship. Um, what was your goal? I think that's probably going to be one of the tough things for me too, is understanding like when to consider them done. So what was your goal for Battleship? Is there a specific endpoint that they... Oh geez, I just almost sickled the dog. Yeah, I wish mine didn't have a timekeeper chip. Be nice if this game gave a little more feedback as to what's going on. Uh, this... Okay. Music sounded different, but maybe it's just the fact that it's not just rain. Tomorrow. Want a match on every mode. Okay. Battleship on Game Boy I enjoyed a lot. It's long, and some people don't like how long it is, but... I thought it was a nice variation. Still unhappy? What does it take to make these cows happy? Uh, I should possibly buy more croissants pretty soon. About... Don't need to milk any cows yet. Well, that'll be good. I, that honestly might be one of the first ones that I play. I was thinking either that or the Tetris. Something, something simple and basic. And then maybe going into something like Seventh Guest or um, Boyer. 3DO does look really cool. I would love to have a 3DO. I have no idea how much those might be these days. Got to walk the cows. CDI. Okay, so the reason I do Game Boy is because there's. You know, the first console I was allowed to buy with my own money. Growing up, we had Atari 2600, and eventually my parents got us the Commodore 64 as well. 
uh, but they never let us have a Nintendo or Super Nintendo or anything. But they let me save up my allowance money to buy a Game Boy, so that was like my thing. So like it's all about you know history and nostalgia and all that kind of good stuff. CDI kind of has the same type of appeal to me because I used to stay up a lot of late nights watching infomercials for everything, and you know the CDI infomercials are some of my favorites, and I always wanted that console. So, um, <laughs> you know, it has that like magic. Even though I know it's a garbage console, like it's still <laughs> it's it's that feeling of of nostalgia that's attached to the CDI. So, 3DO just looks like it has a lot of really good, interesting games. It's it's what the CDI should have been if everything went down properly. Uh, Japanese model 3DO. You just need a step down converter for voltage when you plug it in. That wouldn't be too hard. I'll have to see if I can... I'll think about it. it the, I think my biggest problem right now is I'm trying to downsize a lot of my stuff. I have my th uh, 32X, I have my Sega Saturn, I'm gonna get rid of both of those. I don't... I never play them. Anytime I'm playing retro games, it's for stream, as I'm sure you're probably in the same boat there. <laughs> so if I want to play games and not talk while I'm doing it, then I usually play PlayStation 4 or Switch. Oh, that's not bad. Oh, that's really appealing. Japanese model for 100 bucks. I'll have to see what the wife might think about. Well, I mean, she won't care. I mean, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, it's it's my money, but, like... She'll probably just say, like, are you sure you really want to do that? So I can plant more stuff as soon as I get these things ready for delivery. Okay. Oh. How many of you played on, on 3DO? I know you did Road Rash, right? Because you've done... Um, sorry, you said that the Game Boy Color is your second to last Road Rash, right? I think that's... That's everything... Harvest wise. Okay. Let's double check my seed count. 14 bags. We're good on seeds. Oh, the GBA. Okay. I'm not sure if I have a way to burn games at this point. I used to burn DVDs all the time. Don't tell anybody, even though it's being recorded right now. I used to, you know, rent them from the Netflix DVD delivery service and burn them and send them back. But never got into burning games. I 
confused about when I'm going to get this pickaxe that the game says exists. And there's also supposed to be an umbrella. If you've impressed the ranch spirit, he may reward you with a magic rain-making umbrella. Fishing pole. Use it to catch fish that might supplement your farming income. Some of this stuff might be year two only. But the manual doesn't say. Hmm. Alright, so I've done, done that. Oh god, did the time keep going while I was in there? Plant some new seeds. I have this whole giant farm, but there's just not enough time in the day to actually utilize it and plant things in all corners of the whole thing. Seems like this game has a lot of good ideas, but you know, it's Game Boy, so it just doesn't have the ability to execute, the, execute them very well. I feel like, you know, aside from a little bit of daily busy work of... ...watering and gathering crops, there's not much to do. And I don't know what to do with all this money that I'm gathering. little directionless. See, you're full of all the good ideas. I'm I'm not tech savvy at all. If you follow me long enough you'll realize that um I never would have even thought that there might be an external <laughs> external uh, CD writer that I could get. I'm just thinking back to the days when I bought one for my computer, my tower desktop. I think everything's done. I don't think there's anything else I need to do. Double check that I fed the chickens. Yep. Oh, I don't think I fed, I don't think I visited the spirits. So I will do that. <laughs> See, on, and then on my side, it took me like three years to learn how to do overlay stuff and stream OBS. I was just going directly from a capture card for a long, long time. Completely different levels of tech savvy. room and then nothing see I need this pickaxe I'm a I'm assuming that there's going to be a reason to pick through that whole thing my fear with this game is that I'm going to get through winter, and I'm not going to make the goal because I haven't gotten enough of these berries. Um, I'm also calling the dog every night, thinking that that might help. I'm trying to, like, anticipate what the game wants me to do. There's these ten stamina berries. I got one of them from the sprites down there. I found four of them while... Um, using my hoe to clear out the entire field of the farm. And there's five left to find. My fear is that I will not, you know, make Grandpa happy unless I get 
close to all 10. And so I, you know, I'm losing it. I feel like I'm losing already. Getting colder day by day. It'll rain all day tomorrow. That sounds good to me. Right, do we have happy cows? Unhappy cow. Unhappy cow. Blah. Took you months to figure out how to make it work for CDI. You mean like getting it um, to capture your CDI? The overlay that I'm using right now, my brother made for me. He's a graphic designer and, you know, he's done some stuff, so. Oh, making CDI games. Oh yeah, that that does sound difficult. It's also something I'm not going to worry too much about. 3DO games, I'd be interested in burning, but CDI, that's another one where I'm going for... Mostly a full collection. I just don't care if I have the kids' games. So, I could care less if I have Sticky Bear and Berenstein Bears and Sesame Street stuff. I want all of the uh, actual interesting games. I don't have the brush with me. brush with me. Push the cows out the door for their daily walk. That took me a while to figure out. The manual has it written wrong. <laughs> I appreciate that. I will I will definitely let you know. I should look at the 3DO game list too. That might help me decide if I want to try for it. I mean if I do get rid of my Saturn that will clear up a space on the shelf. Right cow. Here. Alright, thankfully the pregnant cow doesn't move. How's the controller for 3DO? I'm not very um, not very familiar with it. Is it is it sort of like a Genesis type of a deal? Wolfenstein 3D. Pick up the chicken, I want to pick up the egg. I'm blocked. I'm blocked. There we go. Oh, I thought I had the chicken in my hand, not the egg. There goes some money. Ah, uh, so almost... Almost best of both worlds, depending on your perspective.
I'm not sure what uh, CDI controllers you're using, but the uh, the gamepad version with the three buttons is probably my favorite. Dude, this forest runs away so quickly. Time to get the saddlebags that allow me to uh, put my crops in, into the horse. Previously, I had to run each, individ in, each individual crop to this box up here. That was annoying. Race against time, and I think we made it. Uh, oh, 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 quickly before it turns to five. I'm not gonna make it now, am I? Do the daily prayer as much as I can. Oh yeah, Amazing Penguin is good. Oh, <laughs> interesting. You have to play Daisy Chain controllers together with 3DO. Uh, yeah, I played a I played Amazing Penguin a while back ago. Um, I think that's it for North American Game Boy. I think there's like Pengu or something like that for Japan. Aside from that, Penguin Wars is honestly really fun too. Until you get to like, okay, um, that one, I was able to get to about level 24 through natural abilities, um, but the computer behavior and I, I just need to like, I need to work through emulator and, and try to find like a cheese strat because I do want to go back to that game and do a legitimate 1 through 40 run at some point. I just have no way of... I need to figure out ways to manipulate the computer in the later rounds. Because if you knock them down with the ball, they just get up instantly, and it's it's impossible to deal with. Carpenter, nothing. You don't have a pickaxe or anything. Uh, I bought all the tools that you have. Restaurant, I could probably buy some more croissants. Yeah, Penguin Wars is like the unfinished business of this channel. Once I get to the point where I can actually have like emotes, there will definitely be a Penguin Wars emote. Um, I definitely need sprinkler. Don't need the sickle right now. Well, I hope you enjoy a lot of the Game Boy games that you come across eventually. I know it's not a very popular choice. Uh, 
I was just looking at my rankings today, and I'd say I, I've... Um, more than half of the games that I've played have been, you know, above average. With about... 30% being like an 8 or higher. I'm sure some of it's just because I'm biased, but... I think it's underappreciated. I'll go through and use my sorters and try to nominate some good, uh, some good Game Boy games. I know a lot of people like to be the type of guy who... or type of person who will nominate, you know, the... the more difficult ones. Be a little more sadistic with it, but that is not my style. Last thing I want to do. Um, lost the hammer. So I guess it was just a glitch. There's a little graphical glitch, and I thought, well, maybe if I hoe that spawn again, there'll be something I need to pick up there. <clears throat> Turns out the answer is no. What if I give this to you? I've been greeting them and doing this for a season and a half now, and they haven't given me anything new, but they always say, oh, we'll try to help you the best we can. Oh yeah, it definitely does happen. I've already had it happen to me a couple times, unfortunately. There are a couple games that I leave off of those voting forms specifically because I don't think I'm going to have enough time to devote to them um, when their category comes up. Stuff like Championship Pool. Days of Rain in a row. I don't know how to make these cows happy. It takes it's a while. The crops to harvest. I got some stuff to destroy. So I'm removing one from each square at nine because you can't get to the middle one otherwise. Um, And so it just makes watering a lot 
easier and more efficient for me. Stream every day, you talk to him every day. Eat him every day. Walk him every day. And eventually they'll be milk producing happy. Alright, so another thing that the manual gets wrong is evidently there is definitely no event on the 10th day of fall, because I'm well past that now. 14th of fall. The only thing that happened on the 10th is somebody gave me a juice. That does not seem like a vegetable festival, as promised. So I hope I didn't mess something up. Wake up. Do I have the bell? I don't have the bell. Let's go get the bell. I don't need the sprinkler today or tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, there are a lot of bad Game Boy Color games. I have a decent amount of Game Boy Color games just from picking up lots on eBay to fill out my original Game Boy collection. But I have no desire. <laughs> I'm afraid I, I don't really think I'm going to be helping with that. If I do finish this Game Boy Quest at some point, um, I think I just switched to a generic backlog type of a, a thing. I don't have the same fond feelings for Game Boy Color because that came out when I was, uh, you know, done buying Game Boy games. When did that come out? Like, 98? 97? I had to spend all my money on car payments at that point. Getting ready for college in a couple of years. I couldn't buy the latest Rugrats movie adaptation game. <laughs> Nobody ever wants to touch Game Boy Color. It's very true. Here, here's what I'll say. Um, once I have channel points... Uh, I do plan to have some sort of a redeem system so that, you know, people can force me to play other systems in between Game Boy games. So, you can get your wish that way, if and when that happens. Uh, okay, no grass there. Somebody's got to touch all those Mary Kate games, right? All the Tony Hawk and Matt Hoffman knockoffs. <laughs> you wouldn't force Game Boy Color on somebody. Yeah, I, there has to be some good stuff. I would say, you know, stuff like Shadowgate. Is something that came up recently uh, in conversation. I know there's a Game Boy Color version of that. That would be kind of cool. I'm sure there's some decent Game Boy Color games in this 
binder of garbage I have in my room. That's everything? That's the whole day? I think that's the whole day. I just want more Game Boy challengers too to to appear. It seems like the ones that pop up, you know, there's oh, there's there's what two people who are actively doing it besides me. Well, I mean you as well, so I guess that's three. But like focusing primarily on Game Boy, you got Mo and you got Grand and Hero. The other ones just drop off. And it's sad. Oh, three Harvest Moon games on Game Boy Color. I mean, so those would be decent. This game isn't bad. I think it's just... I think it's just pared down a bit too much. I don't know if I need more seeds, but I'm going to buy more seeds. The other bag is grass, so if, if you're wondering why I'm not getting that, it's because it's just... Grass, which is feed for the cows and chickens, and I have enough of that. As it is. Um, yeah, I think I'm done. So yeah, I have this massive... Massive plot of land up here that I've cleared out, and I can't... I don't have time to farm all this. I don't have enough efficiency built into my tool set. Let's go visit the cave sprites. Yeah, I'll find some Game Boy games for you to play. Ooh, 3DS games. Interesting. I think, yeah, part of the difficulty with 3DS is that you need to have a modded system. And those are tough to come by. Or expensive to build. Or is there a good 3DS emulation now? I never even thought about that. This hot spring recovers stamina, so you can just like quickly jump in, recover 20% of your stamina, and then be on your way. Alright, I think that's everything I can do in the day. Call the pet. Let's call the horse too, why not? Let's let him run. And back to the stable with you. Rainy day tomorrow. So, unhappy cows. It's been 15 days in the season, and they've been unhappy this entire season. Maybe I'm walking them too much. No.
I'll figure out how to do my livestock stuff after making sure I can get all these uh, into the saddlebags for shipment. So I'll just have to replant those crops in a bit, and I need my sickle. Which means I actually will need the sprinkler at a certain point. Oh, I have all the cow stuff. It's tough to know if I actually did the brushing. I think I do. But they run away from you when you try to do it. So it's not always easy to tell. Oh. Get up there, go, 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 time for a walk. I know it sounds like it's raining, but it'll be fine once you get out there, I promise. Look at that. Bright and sunny. So it's 9.30 right now. I've played about, gosh, 10 days worth in almost three hours. It's such a long slog sometimes. I don't think I'm going to be finishing the fall season today. I'll be surprised if I make it through the rest of fall. For some reason, this is going slower than some of the other seasons. I don't feel like I'm doing all that much more. Alright, BPN, appreciate it. Talk to you soon. And have a good night if I'm if I'm done by the tenure. Oh. I need to get my seeds. Whoops. Well, I can come down here along here. Thank you very much. We'll also try to help you. But in what way are you going to help me? You have yet to help me in the fall. Seeds, I'm gonna get the watering can. Or sprinkler. 
um, because I need to Even though it's raining out, I need to water the freshly planted seeds. Money just seems so meaningless in this game already. Just weird. I just wish there was more to do. I get. You no, know, why can't I get. Uh, like furniture for the house or. Better tools with the money. Upgrade my stable and chicken coop. Okay, so that's not ready to eat. Do I need any more? I do need more seeds tomorrow. Okay. I'll run and get more seeds tomorrow. Run, run, run. I have to assume that I have enough, um... grass to last me through the... I could probably do some quick calculations. I mean, I'll need, uh, I'll need 30 times 8, right? So, 240. After fall's done. What if I feed them extra? Seven. Will that matter? Will they care? So I have 352 already. It seems like a good buffer. Like I, I should definitely have enough.
and also assuming that the manual isn't lying about how this stuff works. Um, the grass fodder is better for them than the cow feed you can buy. Oh, that's not open yet. I only have about 10 days left of planting. There will be crops in winter though, I know that for sure. I think they're going to be recurring crops, too. Animal crops, uh, animal storm. I think it's going to be in potion. There's no reason for me to have an in potion anymore. Alright, let's go harvest. Sickle work for later. Oh, I really messed up the planning of those.
need to take a sickle to move anything, I don't think so. That's a loud train. Um, I'm bringing the axe in, you never know. Maybe they'll see the axe and be like, oh yeah, by the way. by giving me a fishing pole? Because I would like to have a fishing pole or a pickaxe. I really want to be able to do something with this area. What's the point in opening it so early on in summer if it's just going to sit dormant for 45 days without the ability to do anything? Maybe they got the vegetable festival day wrong. It's actually going to be on the 20th. I'm going to assume that's probably not true, but you know. Sure does seem like it takes a long time to get these cows happy. All the chickens are fine. Why can't it be like the chickens? I should probably go get more drink. Uh, in the next couple days. At least I'm glad I figured out that you can push these guys out the door. I'd probably never have a milk producing cow if I didn't stumble upon that.
game really does make me want to play some more Stardew, though. What do I want to try to do real quick? I'm just curious. It's not. I mean, the manual says something about how you could possibly uh, use the wood to mend fences. And I thought that, that was going to be a factor once the earthquake hit. It was not. Oh no, I'm sorry. It does not say anything about the X being used for, for fences. Uh, it says about... Um, where did I see that? Carpenter. No. Not all your house. I know for a fact I saw something about how... play thing it definitely makes it look like I'm doing everything I'm supposed to be doing but it's really really tough to know for sure because it just doesn't seem like I'm doing enough it seems like I, unless I did everything by you know early summer and now I'm just kind of staying the course for a while hmm. Nothing new in the manual that I can learn. Uh, do I need this sickle? I mean, I might. I definitely don't need the brush, so... Once for us, your wandering has been a help. Assuming that should be the only one that I have to do. Alright, I do have to water a bunch of stuff and I have to sickle some stuff, but other than that, we're good. 
So let's go into town. Um, I need to go to the juice bar later tonight. I honestly have no clue what the fortune is actually supposed to try to tell me. Don't need more seeds, I don't think. I have what I need. Just grab. Sixty sounds good. It's dark. It looks so gross. Okay. Also a little hard to tune your eyes to that stuff to work, but it... Time to do my um, my grass sickling. All the water's done. Uh, let's go in and replace that. Let's go. Oh shoot, is it too late to get the... Hold on. Let me check the manual before even going to the town. Juice bar is open till midnight. Yeah, too late. Okay. I mean, I'm not in drastic need of more juice, but it could help a lot. Right, I'll just stop there, because that's... Three AM. I don't wanna be completely exhausted by the next day.
I don't know, maybe they don't want to be walked as much. Cows are good, right? I did talk to him. I'll, I'll talk to him again real quick. Just to make sure, because I know I brushed him. Yeah, 14 days. Well, pitch. since I've missed with the hay. Alright, no crops to harvest today. Uh, I'm going to pause it for a second and take another quick short break and I'll be right back. We'll play a few more days, a couple more days.
Um, swap out tools. Don't need that. Do you need that? I think I just need to water everything and then I'm good. This should be a pretty quick day. So since I misplanted, I have to figure out the best way to... ...do this, huh? Well, something like that, I guess. I don't know. Maybe it won't be exact, but that's okay. Again, I don't need tons and tons of money at this point. I'm like... Uh, I'm gonna go back into town. Do the daily pray thing. I don't think I need more seeds. Looks great. Something good will happen. That's that's good. I'm, I'm glad that that's true. If it's true, does that mean I'll get the pick? Alright, so yeah, there's one that I messed up on. Whatever. Could be a lot worse. Alright, so all the watering is done. I just need to cut some stuff, probably. Let's bring the axe in. Again, I can hope for the best, since my luck is supposed to be really good today, right? So... Nothing. Maybe the fishing pole, then.
Regular axe definitely does not break that stuff. There's so many spots to destroy down there too. It's so disappointing that I'm not able to do any of it. Um, I don't need more seeds, right? I did buy a bunch. Yeah, I got 20 bags still. So. I that's probably good for the whole. season, if I had to guess. Since I only have seven more days to... mess with stuff in the first place. everything. So I just need to go to the juice bar. Oh, you have milk now. Interesting. Okay. That's funny. She just sells me my own milk back to me. You know what? I'll take the orange juice because I'm here and I may be buying a certain amount of orange juice from her will allow some other event to happen. size large milk size medium sweet all right so we got two cows worth milking finally and we got another two weeks before uh before another cow is good to go that is fantastic all right drink i got 15 15 10 food i got 10 16 17 all right log go see some cows. Gotta do some brushing. Gotta do some talking. Some feeding. And some... I'm honestly surprised that both of them are considered to be happy at the same time. yet, which is also really good.
Yay! The happy cow animation. Alright, that's all set. On to the chickens. in a row I whiff on that these guys are becoming a problem Maybe the good luck wasn't referring to the spirits, but more so the fact that uh, I could finally get milk producing cows. One of the stupidest bits of planting I've done.
I'm a little bit better at getting the hang of uh, how to do all that stuff. All right, so everything I think is good. I just need to visit with the sprites. I don't need the bell right away, if at all. I can swap it out for the milker since I should be getting milk every day now. Finally. There's load. Alright, let's head on in. Another clear day tomorrow. Oh, days of delivery. We got two large milks coming up. Sounds good. Sounds like I'm actually making progress. Twelve days till delivery. Good about your brushing. Did that work? That's it. Okay, cool. Just in case it's needed. Uh, Alright, I think this is probably going to be the last day that I stream tonight. It's already about 10.30, which is a little bit later than I typically am able to go. Finish this up. I mean, progress is progress. I just wish that there was like more activities opening up. That's the best way to put that, I guess. I really want that pickaxe. All to say, I really want that pickaxe. And the fishing rod. Uh, probably possible, but it's just not something I can get until year two. Is 
Is there a way for me to know for sure? No, there is not. Not without looking it up, and I don't want to. I think I should have a harvest ready to go. Maybe? Oh, maybe not. Yeah, yeah, I do. Okay. Missed directional input there. Let's hope the brush. Uh, I need the sickle as well at some point. I'm gonna wait to do like a bunch of them until about the 25th. I might buy a bunch of new seeds. And, uh, uh, do, do, do. Carpenter has nothing for me. Yeah, nothing. There's no sense in buying the material. I need. Shit. 
run through this real quick, right? I can't cut much of that grass down since it's 11 already. Very curious to know what happens. What if I feed this guy too? You know? Hoping that maybe I'll get lucky with that. Alright, I got some of the grass there. I think I have plenty of grass overall for the rest of the, the year. So, we will go to sleep. Make sure there's no like in-game event. Yeah, we're good there. And, uh, yeah, we're gonna call it there. So we went through almost 20 days. It went slow. It went slow today. Uh, but when I play again tomorrow, we should be back and get through most of winter. I'm hoping. Um, yeah, we'll see. We'll see how this goes. But yeah, thank you very much for watching. Uh, thank you for stopping by, as always. And uh, hopefully we'll see you again for the next part real, real soon.